I am on my way to work and it's a brand new week for me so that means a brand new week for ColourPop Keeper and Tosser. Still going. And today I'm going with something I've never never worn before. Um, I have never even tried them on before and it is the Ultra Glossy ColourPop. Hmm. This is the Wolfie in the Ultra Glossy formula from ColourPop. Um, it's a little bit brighter than I thought it would be but I kind of really like it. Just strange for me. So let's talk about this formula, this glossy formula. It's more creamy, it's very opaque, a lot of color payoff. It's still glossy, but it doesn't have any of that tacky or sticky feeling like a glossy formula would have. It's actually more of a cream, just with a high gloss. This shade in Wolfie has a sheen to it. Um, not glitter, not uh, metallic, it's a sheen. It's kind of like a color change kind of sheen to it. So far, I really, I said so, I really like the application of it, how it went on, I like how it feels, so we will give it a shot tonight. Let's do this. I don't know if I can pull off this color in that kind of bright fuchsia almost, but um, hell, I'm adventurous, I'll give it a shot. We'll see how it goes. Check in later. Okay, now that I've gotten here and I'm sitting still in my car, I'm a little concerned that this color is way too bright for me. I don't know. I don't know. We'll see what everybody says. And I will check in at the end of the night and let you know what everybody's thinking or maybe in the middle. Um, kind of get some reaction to this brighter color on me. But so far, I, I do like the formula. Ah. I was saying, I was really nervous about wearing this color, but it turned out really good. Um, it wears incredibly well for being a glossy lipstick. Um, it's not at all like gloss because you would expect it to wear like a glossy, like kind of tacky, kind of sticky. Zero at all, none at all. ColourPop hit this one out of the park. I could this be an everyday lip color? Damn straight, it could be. Um, it wears that well. Um, and the only regret is I wish I would have worn a lip liner or so. The ColourPop Wolfie in the glossy formula is a thousand percent a keeper. I love it to Mises Pieces, it's excellent. Keeper, keep. And now I know um, tomorrow, because I want to try another one of the glossy um, lipsticks, is that I will be wearing a primer with that one tomorrow. So that was my bad. Not color pops. Mine. Mine. And that is all for today, tonight. And um, I'll get into the lippy stick soon also. So we're going to make it through the rest of that box that I showed before and moving on. Today, the Kathleen Lights, I believe it's the Kathleen Lights collab in Aquarius. Um, I got the lippy stick and the lippy pencil going on. I really like it. Why have I never worn it before? Wrong, wrong. But for some reason, I just have stayed away from the lippy sticks. But I really like this one. It's really creamy. It's the cream formula. Like it. Pretty. So when you look at the Aquarius on the two or online, it looks like a deeper color, but on me, it comes off more like a nude rose pale color. We're gonna give this an all day wear, see how it goes, and I will check in later on tonight, and see you in the next stop. Bye. So it wears great, it lasts all day. Um, I had to reapply it a couple times, no big deal. I'm um, just normal touch up stuff. Cream formula, mm, love it. So I just said so, again. Aye, aye, aye. Um, I just got off work, and yeah, I was wearing the ColourPop lippy sticks. So just a reminder, I was wearing the Kathleen Lights, I think, um, Aquarius lippy stick and pencil, and it is completely a keeper. I really, really, really don't know why I waited. I really don't know why I waited so long to try the lippy sticks. Um, I really like this cream formula in Aquarius. I like the color, I like the wear, I like everything about it. It's a keeper. I think it's because ColourPop puts out so many different shades, and I think I gotta collect them all like they're Pokemon. And so now that I've gotten so many, now I'm kind of going backwards. So bottom line is, I think I've only been hurting myself and not using these more often. So I'm going to be going backwards and using more of the lippy sticks. Hmm, here I come. So that is all for tonight. I am headed home and I will see you in the next snap. Bye. I swear the wind plays havoc. On, I mean, look at this craziness. 
Ignore it. I'll have to look it when I get to work. Oh yeah, yeah. Hello. Um, today I am sticking with the ColourPop, of course, but I am still doing the lippy sticks. Today I'm going with Brink. I'm wearing the Brink pencil and the matte Brink lippy sticks. And normally I don't like matte, but this one is different. This is the original matte formula um, in the lippy sticks, not the X matte. I don't know why I have skipped it for so long because I like it a lot. Shocker. So even though I was kind of like, ah, oh, do I want to try a matte formula on a Friday night and struggle with it? I was like, yeah, I'm going to go for it. So, so far, damn it, I kind of stopped saying so. When I started applying it, I realized right away that this is not your standard like liquid lipstick, uh, matte lipstick. This is like a cream matte. It goes on creamy and then it dries down matte. Right away, I liked the color. Um, I liked the way that it applied. Pretty happy that I'm wearing a lippy stick again and they're not getting neglected. And I will check in later tonight. Well, I just got off work and I just said so again. But I had one of those shitty, I just don't give a flying frog ass kind of nights. But my lipstick looked good. And I gotta admit, I really like the matte formula in the lippy sticks way more than I like the liquid. Sorry, ColourPop, but I like these better. Mm, good ones. I can't believe I neglected these poor lippy sticks for as long as I did, and because I really like them, and I think I have a new ColourPop order waiting at home for me. Row, row. Today, after I got here, I realized I did not do my little snaps from this morning. Good job. I was tired. So because, oh, I said so. Since I didn't do it earlier, today I wore another lippy stick in the color button. Button, button. And there's a shadow across my face and I get it. I don't know if it's gonna show up, but I can see it, but whatever. Anyway, moving on. Um, I'm wearing button. It's in a satin cream kind of formula. I'll, I'll insert like the little picture because I'm not sure I'm saying it right um, and I can't find it in my purse. I know it's there. Anyway, the color looked like it would be a lot more pink, but when I put it on, I realized it was actually more of like just a neutral nude color on me. Um, I really like it, and I really like it. It's a nice neutral. I could see wearing this on just a regular day, maybe on a no makeup day or a low makeup day. Um, it's definitely can do a lot with it. So the good and bad of it is that here's another keeper that I really like in Button, um, but then I'm not getting rid of anything, which was supposed to be the whole point of this, but at least I'm getting my money's worth, right? So that was a super short review on Button, and um, I will put the little picture in here so everybody knows what I'm talking about. And I'm headed home. See you next snap. Bye. I didn't really give it a good review, did I? Hey, just real quick, it applies really nice. It's nice and creamy. It's a great satin finish. It looks pretty all day long. It lasted a long time. Easy touch-ups. I have to report today. Hmm. Off to work. I know what I wanted to say. Um, everybody always complains about ColourPop shipping takes forever. I've never had that problem. I don't know if because there I'm in California, they're in California. But I, I ordered this less than a week ago and all of them showed up um, two days ago. So it literally was maybe four days total turnaround time. That's pretty impressive. Diego. Hey, this is really corally pink. I don't know if I can pull this off. I'm a little nervous. It's really pink. Like, so big shocker, I'm off work when it's still light outside. And I still worked uh, nine hours, so I'm just got nine hours of wear. That's pretty good. 
today I wore the November, which I literally just got in the mail like two days ago. I really like it. It's a little pink, maybe more of a spring color. I don't know. So I really like the, the November also. So another keeper. Again, another keeper. Um, can't help it. This also rounds out the this week of ColourPop. So we ended on a good note with November. It being long wearing and great and wonderful. I'm in the ultra satin. So I do have a lot of ColourPop left still. I don't know if I want to keep on going with the ColourPop. If I just want to switch it up for one week. So we'll see you next week. Bye.